that is, you know, that's such a self-evident question. So a health impact assessment, as you know, can be deployed um, on, on any um, change, whether it is building a new road or closing an airport or financing childcare or uh, a, a, a trade partnership between two countries, all of those things can be subjected to the rigorous process of health impact assessment. Uh, and, and as you know, we, we, we've done those health impact assessment on trade partnerships, on uh, air, airports, on nuclear power plants. Um, and so globally, uh, obviously health impact assessment is the tool of choice for our sector um, to, to, to look at urban change globally, because we are an urban planet. So yes, HIA is there. And all the other impact assessment, because there's, there's other ways of doing this. Um, and I honestly feel, and, and you've been part of those discussions, um, that we need to sharpen the toolbox for HIA, that we need to in the age of big data and, and data visualization, that we should become even more sophisticated in dealing with the enormous masses of data that we have to our, to our disposal to actually make HIAs um, quicker, better, faster, um, and more relevant. Um, so the answer is yes, there is a role and it's obvious.